Hi everyone, it's Jessica from A Turn to Learn, and I wanted to show you what you could do if one of your students is getting video pop-ups no matter what website they're visiting. So basically, if your student is getting some videos popping up in one of the corners of their screen, it means that they probably installed an extension that they weren't supposed to. So if you look in the top right-hand corner of Chrome over here, you can see I have my Screencastify extension that I use to record video. You can also see that there's another extension here called Fidget Spinner. This is something that I don't know if it actually installs videos or not, but I know that the Fidget Spinner extension was one that was very popular with my students when Fidget Spinners were a thing. But this is something that I don't personally want on their Chromebook and also something that might be causing those video pop-ups. So what we want to do is remove that extension. So the way you would do this is you would right click on the extension and you can do that by pressing two fingers down at the same time or by holding down your alt key and clicking. And you want to click remove from Chrome. Now doing this will remove the fidget spinner extension from Chrome and your students will no longer have access to it. The other thing that I do want to point out is you might look up here and not see anything suspicious. But if you were to click these three dots, you can see there's links here to more extensions. Now this here is Red Ball Games. Again, I don't know if this is something that does provide advertisements on students computer, but I do know that it's something that I wouldn't want my students to have. So again, I would right click on this extension and just click remove from Chrome. Hopefully by removing the faulty extensions, your students will stop seeing those video advertisements. The other thing that I just want to mention is if you're not sure if an extension is approved by your school or not, I would check with your tech department because you don't want to uninstall something that the district did push out to the Chromebooks. But if you do see something that you know doesn't belong there, it's nice and easy to remove yourself. Enjoy!